Hello guys and welcome to Diamond Shine with Shanta. Um, today I'm going to be bringing you an unboxing from Diamond Art Club. We'll be unboxing Lilies and Pearls by Christine Karen. But before I get into the kit, I just want to real quick show you all, share this with you guys. So she is another artist um, who does coloring books. Um, if you um, like to do adult coloring. And um, she also has a Patreon um, where um, if you join, it's just $1 a month. And she gives you, gives you a downloadable coloring sheet every month. So I am one of her um, Patreons and I get a free coloring sheet every month. Um, she has tons of books um, that's available and just beautiful images. So, I just wanted to share that with you guys. So, let's get into the good stuff. So, um, this is a round canvas. in the restock as soon as it came out. Um, it was one of the kits that I wanted. It is um, 20 inches by 27 inches of 51 centimeters by 69 centimeters. Shipping a two kit. I hope I got either a rose or a macaroon. I prefer a macaroon, but I'll take either one. <gasps> Another macaroon, guys. Another teal one. I love it. I think I have three teals now, one yellow and one green. I've also been getting a lot of these um, magenta pens. So I have a magenta um, pen and squishy. We have some real pretty washi tape. I'm just gonna start showing the pen and the um, washi tape and the cover minder and then I'm gonna Insert a picture of what else is included. Again, I'm tearing this bag up again. I don't know why. Sometimes I can get them open really good. And sometimes I just rip them to shreds. And this one definitely got ripped to shreds. So Diamond Art Club's canvas is a very, very soft canvas. I don't know why lately it's been coming with these little linty. Oh, she's so pretty. Oh my goodness. Oh, she's beautiful. And in the way that it's done, it's like it's a portrait. Smooth it down and let it lay flat for me. Okay, so I know what I don't want to see. I probably left it in the box. Let me see if I got it. Yep, I left it in the box. My small um sticker it says Lilies and Pearls by Christine Karen. Um, some people put this sticker on their box. Um, when they store it, they'll know what the kitty is. I myself, I use it in my log book. I actually put both stickers in my log book. Um, so this is a really nice sticker. Um, Lilies and Pearls by Christine Karen. It gives you a start and end date. It gives you a really nice um, large um, picture of the image. It also tells you that it is a round. Um, it gives you the dimensions of the painting. Um, this particular painting has 48 colors. And it looks like it has three ABs. So, um, Diamond Art Club, they use um, numbers, um, letters, and symbols um, for their, in their legend. Let's take a look at the canvas. She is stunning. Oh my goodness, she's so pretty. I think it's really interesting the way they have it, um, kind of like as if this is a picture, almost kind of like a frame around the edge. I think that's really beautiful. 
and then um, you have the lilies, um, which I like lilies. I, I like them because um, where I live, I um, live in Tennessee, um, we can um, grow lilies and they come back. So if you have, uh, if you um, plant lilies in your yard after the winter, they will come back. So I, I like lilies. Um, I love um, um, perennials, flowers that come back every year. And then these are the pearls. It's just beautiful. Oh my goodness, y'all. She is so pretty. Look at her profile. Let's look, let's look up. She is just beautiful, guys. Look at her profile. Oh my goodness. She is so pretty. Look at the detail of the flowers. Oh, she is going to be a stunner, guys. Oh, she's so pretty. Look at the detail of her necklace. Oh, my goodness. She's so pretty. She's just beautiful. She's beautiful. So, let's take a look at the drills. Oh, I guess I didn't even discuss the camera. So, let me do that. I got, I got so enamored by how pretty she is. Okay, so first on the canvas, it is... um. Scalloped and it has some type of surgeon to prevent fraying. Um, they give you a legend on the top left and the bottom right, which I love because I paint um, from the top coming down. Um, also, let's check the stick of the canvas. Very sticky. Down on earth. I've never had a canvas that wasn't sticky. And I'm sure it happens, but it's never happened to me yet. I mean, no company can be perfect. And then if we look at simple clarity... Very clear. Again, I've yet to have a canvas where the symbols weren't clear. I'm sure it happens every now and again, but I have never received one yet. So I just love this. So now let's take a look at the drills. The drills are labeled lilies and pearls. So if you store your canvas um, separate from your drills, you'll know what um, canvas the drills go to. I just throw mine back in the box. I am sorry for the crinkling. Once I see this for the fingers. And let me say, I picked her up when she came out, but that was a, a couple weeks ago. I have been doing good on my um, not buying. The only canvas that I probably shouldn't have got was the Over Under, but I did um, purchase that with the Yume Art, so I couldn't help it. I had to get that one. But I, I'm proud of myself. I didn't get anything last week. I'm holding strong. It's hard, but I have done it. And I also like to say this is a nice, manageable size for me. I am trying to... Um, I'm still going to get, um, if it's an image that I love and it's a large canvas, I'm going to buy it. But I'm going to try to buy more um, um, sizes that are more manageable. So let's look at her drills. I'm telling you, these drill strands are so long lately. <clears throat> 407. 702. That is so pretty. We know that's going to be down here in the and the plant 739 160 758 312 3064 3772 311 317 141 that is our first AB um AB um stands for Aurora Borealis it is a drill with a real beautiful iridescent coating um, and this makes your canvas kind of shine a little bit more. And we're getting th um, two bags of 310, not bad. And they're not like um, stuff full, so not bad at all. 413, 37.99, 9.39. Um, two bags of that pretty dark blue. And then we get three bags of 38.65. And I have a feeling that 38.65 is going to be all of the background area. Let me look and see. Yep. So that 38.65 is going to be all around. So that's going to be really beautiful. Okay, let's go up the next strand. This is the stragglers. That's what I call them. 161. 
um, 938. 902, 500, sorry, 132, so that is our next AB. It's not a lot of that one, so I'm going to assume that's going to be in the um, frond of the plant. 3770, um, 100, now that's an AB I don't, I don't ever remember receiving. It's really pretty though. I'm interested to see where this goes. 315, 154, a lower 754. Uh, I'm up here trying to figure out where the where that green AB is going. <laughs> I need to get my mind back on what I'm doing. 3726, 334, 152, 632, 437, 701, one of my favorite greens, and 3771. And then our last strand. Nine forty seven, seven forty, thirty three seventy one, seven sixty two. 3752, 738, 322, 898, 712, 703, 839, and last of all, 803. So I definitely want to see where these ABs go. I'm going to assume um, number one is going, it is, it is in the plant. Um, I'm going to zoom in just a little bit more. Y'all can see real good. So it's all up through here. It's all just kind of highlighting around this border, plant border. That's what I'm going to call it. So it is kind of everywhere, all around in the plant border. And it is also in the lilies. It's all up in here. Going across here. And it is a little bit in the lily at the top as well. Just right here. So just kind of highlighting the lily. And then our next AB is number two, which we know is going to be in the lilies. So it's right here and right here. Um, and it's in every frond pretty much at the very top. And same thing on this one at the top of every orange frond. And then our last one is 141. And I'm going to assume that's number three. That's going to be in the pearls. And it is. So it is a little bit of three in every pearl. I mean, every single one has, has at least one 3AB. Every little spot. It's also highlighting her skin. It is also on the edge right here of the lily. That's all on the lily, on the edge. And just in, in the necklace, I mean, literally every little section of where it's supposed to be a pearl has one AB, sometimes two, but mostly one. Then again, it's going up her skin, her neck, it is dotted in the lily, um, the little dots right there. It's on the edge of the lily. This is going to be beautiful, y'all, on the edge of the lily, up through here. And it's also a line of white AB around the picture frame. I missed that. So, um, oh, this is going to be beautiful. This is going to be absolutely beautiful. Same thing here. It picks up here. The line goes around. We look up here. She has an AB in her eye. Again, highlighting her face. Again, going up in the pearls. It is outlining the lily. This is so pretty, y'all. Just dotted around. And this is going to be beautiful. Again, it's going around the top of the frame. 
is going up through the top of the lily. Y'all, this is going to be beautiful. Even on the, I mean, all in the pearls you got. We got this A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B. Y'all, she is so beautiful. I'm so glad I got this one. I just love her. going to link her in the description box because she is still available if you if anyone wants to pick her up um, she is really beautiful um, if you like portrait pictures or if you've never done one before and you want to try a portrait picture I think this would be a nice one to start on it has um, color blocking and confetti because if you kind of look um, like all this section up in here is color blocking all around here it's color blocking, but then when you get into her hair, it's more confetti. The flower is more confetti, but not horrible confetti. Like all this is color blocking. You know, it's going this is beautiful. I think this would be a nice um canvas if you want to try a portrait. And it's a nice manageable size as well. So I just want to thank everyone for watching my video. I really do appreciate it. Um let me know in the comments if this is on your wish list. Wish list if this is something that you're interested in, or let me know if you if you if you even like portrait paintings. Some people don't like portrait pa paintings. Um, just let me know um, down in the comments. Thank you all very much. I hope everyone's having a great day. Bye.